Welcome to Mega Bets. I is Sonny Vega. And I is coming off a 3 and one night last night. That's a good thing. I ain't no mathematician or anything like that. Believe you me. But in this business, when you can win more games than you lose. Oh yeah, that's a good thing. That's a very good freaking thing. Kind of like me. But enough about me. Let's talk a little about me. And the fact that I am your host for today's show and tomorrow's show. Right? Coming to you with tidbits of information, updates. And oh yeah, some tips that can make us both a little bit of money, honey. I've been handicapping sports half my freaking entire life. I know what I'm talking about most of the time. I've been looking good, smelling good, and dressing good. Yeah, that I've been doing all my freaking entire life. If you don't believe me, ask the ladies. They'll tell you so. Taylor, how are ya? Bella, let me be your fella. What's poppin', shorty? One heck of a woman right there. Holler at your boy. And maybe we can become more than just mega friends here at Mega Bets. Bella, nice to meet ya. Before I get to tonight's action, though, four games that I'm in love with. We'll get to that in just a moment. But first, you're here at Mega Bets. This is where the grown-ups play every freaking day. They're looking for the best handicappers at the end of each and every month. Chance for you to get your paws on some real prizes you see there on top of my freaking head. Let's see if you got what it takes. It's mega bets. It's mega freaking fantastic. I mean, these guys even give out a prize for the handicapper with the worst record. You know my feelings about that. If it was up to me, I'd give him a slap in the head and call it a day. But it wasn't my freaking idea, so be it. Alright, to tonight's actions, let's get started, let's get her done. Four games I'm in love with. Three and one last night, looking to continue that into tonight. In MLB, LAD, they lost five games in a row now. Lowe's on the mount, they're at the Brewers. I'm liking them a lot, you're going to want to take them. LA Dodgers, also New York Yankees in the American League. The Moose is on the mount for them, they're at Tampa. Tampa's one last night and beat them the night before that. I'm liking the Yankees in this one. In hockey, same type of situation I spoke about last night. Pittsburgh Penguins, we decided that they're going to win that series, so we keep batting them, we keep hammering them until they close out the series. Same situation tonight with the Detroit Red Wings. They're up three games to none in the series. I've decided they're going to win this series, therefore, you keep betting them and you keep hammering them until they win that fourth freaking game. Simple, huh? Uh-huh. Now we're on the same freaking page. Take them on the money line, minus 170. I'm loving them. Go small on them. Leave yourself enough bankroll to double it up and triple it up if may be the case. That's how we bet. Last but not least, in the association. Now who do you take here? LeBron freaking James that jumps over freaking buildings? Or Sam Cassell, the freaking alien in the Celtics? I can't, can't get nothing done. I'll tell you who you take. Nobody. Same situation with the Lakers in Utah. Who do you take there? Nobody. I'm taking the under though. 212 and a half. I'm liking it a lot. Looking to go 4 and 0, oh, bro. I'll see you tomorrow, you bunch of freaking walnuts. Keep your heads up. 